Hi, I'm Sherry, and this is my channel, Vanilla Vine Pottery. I first would like to welcome all my new subscribers, so thank you for that. I really appreciate it. I mean, who ever thought that even one person would follow me on YouTube? Just a regular old gal trying to make pottery on her back patio and sell it on websites. So I'm trying to start, trying to run my own business, and this is really what this channel is about. It's fall. Happy fall. I live in South Florida, so it's not really fall. In fact, I'm sweating to death right now. The humidity and heat are just still unbearable at this point, so there's no cooling off for us in fall in South Florida. I really need a script. I, this is where you really need a script. Today I have some glazing to do on a bisque fire that I did probably like I think maybe two weeks ago and somebody asked me for some coffee scoops. She reached out to me through Etsy and asked me if I could make more because she really didn't want the ones that I had for sale so she asked if I could make them a little more colorful so I made six more of my coffee scoops and I'm going to try and do them in a couple different colors and she could choose the one that she likes. I also made my sister some, she asked me for some Mexican burritos or a little sippy sippy. So these are going to be fun. And then I just, this little horror. I thought this would be really cute in my food blog photos. That's the problem with pottery because you make pieces and then you fall in love with them and you don't want to let them go. So I have tons of pottery that I haven't listed on my Etsy. I haven't really been making any sales on Etsy and I truly believe it's because I haven't posted any new listings and if you don't keep your listings up to date, um, add new listings regularly then I think like you kind of fall down the search results so that is my goal in the coming days is to at least once a day do at least one listing on my Etsy because I have things like these salad servers that I just haven't listed at all and these are really cute I actually did a video on these when I made them so I'll link that for you in the description and right here. These are gonna be for sale on Etsy. With nobody knowing me, I literally managed to sell pottery. And I was selling a lot like last fall. I don't know if it's inflation or again, me just not making new listings and posting those for people to see, to keep up in the rankings in Etsy. So. That's interesting. That's another side of a small business that you don't really get to see or, or potters don't really talk about because it's a headache and nobody likes to remit and pay sales tax on their e-commerce store. It's just not fun. And my fan broke and I am literally sweating buckets. It's, it's so hot. As some of you know, glazing is not one of my favorite tasks and pottery. I have some mini pottery that I did and I really need to get my mini pottery glazed. I have some pieces for family members that they've been waiting patiently for that they asked me to make. Everyone gets something free from me and then if they want something else they have to pay for it like everyone else because I'm running a business not a free pottery shed. I, I mean it's family I love you but I'm running a business here. I decided when somebody makes a purchase on, on either my Squarespace website or my Etsy that I'm just going to include one of these little tiny pottery pieces just as a thank you because I really appreciate A, when someone is able to find me on either my website or Etsy. So I thought that would just be a cute little extra add-in because who doesn't love something free? I know I do.
me on my Instagram and TikTok accounts at Vanilla Vine Pottery. Thanks for watching and keep on potting.